And the All-America candidate at tight end, Greg Dulcich. Britton Brown is the offset back. And Thompson Robinson to throw into the end zone incomplete over through Phillips. Second down out of the pistol here. Dietrich will call his own number. Looking for a block on the edge and he's cut down at the 10 yard line. Pressure coming. UCLA picks it up initially and then the push up the middle. First and 10 for UCLA, a field goal with a very short field to open the game and another overthrow. To get him in the flow of this game. Great line from Justin Fry yesterday, he said the passing game is like music. You gotta find your rhythm, you gotta get into a groove. Maybe a little run game will. They don't have center Sam Marazzo. They hope to have him next week, uh, but the rest of that line is intact. And another big hole up the middle. Nearly seven yards per carry last year. The best at UCLA since the late 80s. And they'll keep it on the ground. Creating some space for Brown. Another new guy, one of the nine transfers for the Bruins, Zach Charbonnet. At that back spot. Could be a really good one-two punch. Trying to set up the screen, Hawaii was all over it. Thank you very much, Matt. Third down play for UCLA, and they will get the fresh set of downs. It's Zach Charbonnet. Already in the red zone once today, picked up three. Looking for more, big gaping hole up the middle. Charbonnet takes it the distance. 21 yards and a touchdown Bruins. From the defensive front. He returns at 11 yards to set up UCLA again. Keep the pedal to the metal. Brown, no gainer. Power game down inside the one yard line for Brown and it's fourth and goal. Britton Brown is the back from the one. Brown sidesteps into the end zone. Touchdown, UCLA. Left the Pac-12 footprint. And a job one for all the coaches is to try and keep guys like that at home. A big game against USC that really opened a lot of people's eyes. DTR takes it, hurdles at midfield, and down he goes. Putting yourself in harm's way, I get it. The athletic ability of Thompson Robinson, something you don't want to see your quarterback take those kind of hits. Just get down to the ground, move on to the next play. Over 100 yards rushing now for UCLA. And why not more of the same? Keep feeding them. Charbonnet refuses to go down, and he'll go the distance. Just getting a hand in there, knocking that ball away. Q Lake. Thompson Robinson looking to get something going through the air. Fires it deep downfield into double coverage. See if they get some short underneath throws to really get his confidence going. Off the left side and a gain of about four for Britton Brown. Have harpened his career so far. Blitz coming up the middle. It's picked up and very close to first down yardage is Kyle Phillips. Thompson Robinson looks front. Comes back to the backside. Terrific route by Phillips. Big offensive line. Lots of experience. You know, they took their lumps in their younger days. First down, Charbonnet. Down to about the 21. Get their season started next weekend. Charbonnet, another big gainer. Terrific block downfield and a touchdown. Churning it out on the ground. Zach Charbonnet, 106 yards rushing, three touchdowns in his UCLA debut. Cam Brown, a Texas A&M transfer. They're trying to find, get this passing game going as well, but this run game right now seems to be what UCLA may be leaning on heavily this season. I'll try on the ground again. <laughs> but since we are in the Keith Jackson broadcast uh, yes. center, <laughs> we had to dress it up in honor of Keith. Best throw from DTR we've seen today. Just missed out.
Third down and eight, incomplete. Kind of on us, we gotta play a little bit cleaner. Thank you, Coach. All right, thanks. 47 yards and 21 yards. Dorian Thompson Robinson, quiet uh, in the pass game in that first half. Which we haven't talked enough about today. Yeah, they want to take care of business here in the second half, and uh, then the hype machine will start cranking up. We'll see number two Oklahoma next Saturday. Elusive out at midfield is Josiah Norwood. Bruins are going deeper into the depth chart here. Robinson on this drive alone. They pick up the blitz, allows DTR to look deep downfield, and it's hauled in by Kashmir Allen. Touchdown, Bruins. De'Aaron King, Bryce Young, and then JT Daniels versus DJ Uyunglele. It's going to be a fun day watching these teams compete. What a great sell job by Pavihi. Darius Muasau was the guy that got the tip. Ruins 44-yard touchdown pass earlier in this quarter for DTR. They'll keep it on the ground here. In Tuscaloosa. Good pop out on the perimeter at the 35-yard line by Cameron Lockridge, by the way. And Robinson tripped up at the line of scrimmage. It'll be third and long. High snap on third and long. They pick up the blitz. Incomplete intended for Josiah Norwood. Who loves to compete and definitely won that backup job behind Dorian Thompson Robinson. Hand off on first down. Of course, last year when DTR was out, it was Chase Griffin. Ethan Garbers, a pro style in the pocket, delivering strikes. First and ten, they'll run it again, and it's a good one. Slashing out across the 45, a first down run. In the past, maybe he would try to force balls, play more of a one-on-one -on -one game. Told me he realized he has a lot of Thompson Robinson. Not the best day for him, but definitely an efficient day for the offense. Only been able to run it for 233 yards. We still have the fourth quarter to go. On a third and three. Keeping it on the ground, they'll lose some yardage in his fourth down coming up. Big Labor Day weekend coming up. Flag down behind the play. Keegan Jones down inside the 30. Gus Mel's on now at UCF. Offense, 10 yards from the spot of the foul. Still first down. You know, team, this is uh, one of those weeks where you can finally play someone in another jersey. It's a special, <laughs> special week in college football. And you mentioned it earlier. These two teams have not been back to a national championship game in a very long time. And sort of progress and put their name as an upper echelon program in college football. Oregon right now at the top of the Pac-12 the last couple of years. And they have another Pac-12 team on the schedule in a couple of weeks. They will be at Oregon State. Bruins keep it on the ground. They understand what it is, and it's not even talked about at their program. We could talk about it as announcers, but their program is, hey, it is what it is. Twice in a little bit of a quirky scheduling situation. Work that play clock as much as they can, keeping it on the ground. Kelly, so far today, is showing you this could be a team to be reckoned with. Yeah, it looks like some bad weather, by the way, is uh, coming up in November. Flag coming out of the backfield. Find its way into the top 25 at some point this season. Second and 19, Garber's taken down in a sack back at the 45. Close by, it's really been about them. They don't start school for another month. Yeah, UCLA quarter so. system. It's really been about the closeness, which really 